Hey guys, Auto here, welcome back to the playthrough. So, we are headed to Watson because we are finally going to go and pick up the cyberware uh, that Wakako promised us from the Ripper Dock for doing that gig for her way back when. Oh, the car doesn't hit me. Need to be on the other side of the road. Here we go. Dude, you nicked my car. I mean, you nicked my bike. All right. But on the way, I do want to stop off at V's apartment because I've uh, been carrying around a lot of stuff. Whoop, whoop. Yeah, so on the way, I just want to stop off at V's apartment because um, our inventory is filling up fast. We've been picking up a lot of things. So we need to offload some of that so we can pick up more things and scavenge even more. Now, um, the gig and her apartment are in the same area. They're both in Watson. So it's kind of on the way. Hello? Ah, you want to sell me another car? This one looks a little bit nicer than that beat up thing <laughs> you tried to sell me before. She says, hi V, got a quartz waiting to be checked out. Fire machine, well taken care of, polished to a shine. Bought it off a certain gentleman who was a little whacked when it came to cars, huffing and puffing in his garage day in, day out. Until that is, his wife filed for divorce. Cars all had to go to pay legal fees. Let me know if you're interested. Um, I want to check that out. Where is that? Also up in Watson, it's 29,000 eddies. It's probably the nicest car that's been offered to us so far. But uh, that is not what I want to spend my eddies on at the moment. I would really love to get some cyberware, upgrade my cyber deck. I think that's probably the most important thing for me to do at the moment is upgrade my cyber deck. And the garage is here. There's always so many people walking in front of it though. Let's just park right here. I don't like to fast travel around. I really love to drive around. It just feels so much more you know, like the world is real. Now, have they fixed this? Nope, I still can't pick it up. This dude's hanging around outside my apartment. Alright, home sweet home. Shush you. Let's store some stuff. Alright, so we've stored a bunch of our stuff and freed up our inventory a bit. And now, um, oh yeah, I also changed up my character's clothes a little bit. She's got a bit of a gold theme going on there, a gold biker theme. So those are the guns that I'm going to keep on me at the moment. Um, really keen for uh, these guns to be able to use them because it's, this one's a smart weapon. I've never used one before and I'm really keen to see how that's going to work. And this one is a power revolver that seems to deal quite a lot of damage but we can't use it until we level 12 same with this one actually now that i'm thinking about it i am going to pick up one of the weaker smart guns that i had stored in here just so that when we get the uh cyberware upgrade from the ripper dock that we're going to next uh, we can test out our our new cyberware with a with a smart gun all right this gun Okay, so now I want to disassemble a bunch of items. Before I do that, I have a bunch of perk points to spend, and I want to spend them in my crafting tree. So, there is this perk here called Workshop. Disassembling items grants a 5% chance to gain a free component of the same quality as a disassembled item. Okay, and over here we have another perk. It's called Mechanic, and you gain more components when disassembling. Right, so we finished with that, we just assembled a bunch of items, gained a bunch of um, item components, and now we are going to go and sell the rest. $7.50. 
sell the hazmat suit, sell the tech tactical vest. All right, so we made a few eddies there. There is a side job right in front of me. I was about to go and mark the gig on the map, but there is a side job right here, so we might as well check it out, right? It's only moderate danger. Got another dry, sun-filled week coming your way, Night City. But what do you think, man? You, you ain't can't do that. Ah! Okay, must be Let's below go. us or Don't above sleep. us. I think I'm in sugar shock. Didn't know if I wanted to fuck them or gobble them up. <laughs> if they don't, are you wrong in the head or what? Yeah, maybe you are in sugar shock. <laughs> You're standing on my pile of trash. <laughs> now, do I go up or down? Okay, so it must be below us. NCPD, open up. Barry, we know you were in there. We're here to help. Don't got no fucking warrant. Cut the bullshit. Just open up. We came here as colleagues. Nothing else. Haven't heard from you in a while. We're worried. No, no, leave me alone. Congrats, Mendez. Way to be a prick. Oh, what? So I'm the bad guy? I'm not the one who's holed up playing the attention whore. He lost a friend. Can you blame him? He's not the first or the last. It's called life. Someone in this tower go cuckoo again? This is a private matter, so just move along. Wait, she might know Barry. Is there anything I can do? Shouldn't be talking to cops. I'm gonna ask if I can help. Is there anything I can do? Maybe. You know Barry at all? More or less. Struck up a convo once or twice. He's a friend from the precinct. Left the force not long ago. He broke down after his best friend died. We're worried he'll do something stupid. Relax, hmm. Petrova. Barry's got nerves of steel. He's just a spiteful old bastard. Mendez! <laughs> Could you check on him when he's chilled down? Yeah, of course. Sure, why not? Not like we're miles apart. Thanks. Just... Be patient. Cops falling in rough times can be touchy. I'll see what I can do. Hmm. Interesting. I don't know a Barry. Hey, Barry. Everything all right in there? Hmm. I'll come back in a few hours. No more distractions. None. We are going to get our cyberware upgrade and we're going now. I like my new threads. I look like I should be on this motorbike now. Doesn't she look cool? Oh, she looks so good. Wow, this Ripperdock's really out in the middle of nowhere. Oh, hello? All NCPD subcons. APB out for suspect accused of organized crime activity near Ross Street and Shipyard Way. Scavengers led by Yelena Sidorova, presumed armed and dangerous, have assaulted multiple homeless persons. Night City officials are offering a reward for neutralizing the threat. I wonder where that is on my map. It must be right here. But, um... I'm definitely going to the Ripper Dock first. No more distractions, we are going to the Ripper Dock. Though, those distractions do not include looting. <laughs> We will always loot at all times. <laughs> what is this? This is cool. I've never seen anything like that before. I mean, it's not as good as this gun, but it just looks really cool. There's so many vending machines in this area. What are you gonna find another Pile of trash. It's a pile of gold. It's 
this just where unused vending machines come to die? Like, what is with all of these machines? It's weird. Hi. Oh, hey there. What's this? No. Hey. Now, how long you been on this, man? Tell me this. One more time, I. How long is it supposed to take? Right, damn it. Come on. Oh, it's right there. Look, hey, I'm going yeah. to the Ripper Dock. Hey, now, are you mental? Don't exaggerate. Don't fucking yell at me. Uh -huh. I'm going to the Ripper Dock. Stop distracting me, crime. Seventy-five years of cyberware. Oh, we've read this before. Pretty sure. Hi. How's Biz treating you, Cassius? Lately? Can't complain. MaxTac raided a black clinic not long past. Since then, custom accounts gone up and so my prices. Coincidence? <laughs> you decide. Let's see what's good. Take your pick. Here it is, the Tattoo Tiger Claws Dermal Imprint allows you to use the smart targeting module and smart weapons. Directly links the user's optical implant to the weapon system, offering real-time data tracking. It um, gives the same perks as the smart link, which you need 14 street cred to use. I don't particularly want my character to have a Tiger Claws tattoo, but it's free and I can use smart weapons, so why not? Maybe I can remove it later for something else. Okay, I think while I'm here, I'm also gonna grab a new cyber deck. I really need one. My current one does not have enough RAM. And this one also has a bigger buffer as well. So this is the Biodyne Mark II, nine base RAM, six buffer size, four slots. It is a vast improvement to the one that I currently have. It is 15,000 eddies, but we need it. We need it. So this is the first big chunk of change I'm gonna be spending. All right, Doc. Do you do your magic? Oh, I thought he might do an animation where I get put into a chair and I get a bunch of upgrades, but no, that's that. Hi. What you slot is what you got. The girl brushed a violet lock of hair from her forehead and winked at the man with a silver tattoo standing on the opposite side of the room, sending him the studied smile of a charming ditz. At this moment, Lucy Murray was the fluff-brained daughter of Cosmotech CEO, known for her love of hot pink cars and an IQ that matched her shoe size. She couldn't afford to slip out of character, not if she wanted to finish the job. Hey! She called out in a thin, pouty voice with a note of vocal fry. So glad you came by. Ever since Daddy bought me this cafe for my birthday, almost no one comes here anymore. She had him then, hook, line, and sinker. He turned to look at her, some exaggerated yet flirtatious pity in his expression, then started over toward the counter. Lucy executed a quick scan to identify the organic parts of his body and prepared the hypodermic needle containing the sleeping agent. She took three steps in the tattooed man's direction and, as she's done dozens of times before, pretended to stumble. Of course, he caught her as she fell into his chest. Then, in a blur, Lucy injected the needle into an exposed patch of organic tissue. No gasp of surprise, no shouts, not a single peep as he slumped to the floor. Lucy smiled again, this time in triumph. I have him, Peter, she hollered toward the back room, dropping her sugary valley girl tone. Is the deck ready? Without waiting for an answer, she grabbed her pair of Cosmo Glass and launched the Neural Data Retrieval Program. She was no longer Lucy Murray, but the elusive netrunner known as Bubblegum, the best paid data thief in Night City. But she would not remain for long. In a moment, she would soon become the man with the silver tattoo. 
Bubblegum loved her job. Breaking into people's memories was like riding a brain dance emo high. She felt as these foreign limbs became her own, she absorbed their thoughts, views, and mannerisms. It was no different this time. The tattooed man's mind began to eclipse hers until the last iota of Lucy Murray was pushed out. His name was Mark Collins, and he was walking along a derelict metro tunnel. There was a stale mustiness in the air. Mark Collins hates that smell. It must be about here, he thought. Listen, damned if I know how your neurosystem works, so I'll just say it out loud, he muttered, as if to himself. I know you'll crawl into my mind soon. The job comes from us. This was the only safe way to contact you. In a second, we'll be right below Cosmotech. I'll show you what your father's keeping locked up in basement level 5, so watch close because only you can help us. That took a turn. Cool. Now I want to try smart weapons. Action blocked. Let's go outside. Maybe I'm just not allowed to... Wait, this kid has a gun out. Why can't I have my gun out? Double standards. <laughs> okay. There we go. Smart pistol. Ooh. Ooh. All right. Oh, this is so wicked. I'm gonna have ping. I wanna have contagion. What else? Weapon glitch. Oh, this one's good. Disable the target's ability to move from their current position. Spreads to the nearest enemy within eight meters. That could be really handy as well. All right. Now let's see what is going on in this building. Are you fucking high? You play games with them? Totally hot. Yes, that's it. Mm. When you select the Okay, they're just scavs. Oop, stay hidden. Down there. Okay, so there's quite a few. Ooh, what is this? Ah, epic upgrade components. Nice. Oh, are these all bad guys? Oh, that is so cool! Hmm. Someone shooting me from behind? There we go. Okay. Is she dead? Where are you guys? You did? Okay, you did. Where is the last of them? Oh, 
What? No, wrong gun. Whoa, 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 whoa now, whoa now. I'm gonna need a different kind of bomb for this. EMP grenade. Where is it? Not really letting me though. Let me loot the bot. Hmm. It has the symbol to loot, but I can't do it. It's annoying. Crowbar. Ammo. Cheers. I am digging smart weapons. I really am. That is a nicely painted gun. Yeah, look. He's highlighted that he's got stuff on him. Come on, let me loot the bar. Let me loot it. Go on. What if I do it from here? Oh, that's such a shame. So I wonder what kind of um, loot bots have on them. It looks like a tent. Wait, what? <laughs> For a second I was like, is Takamura inside the tent? No. Hmm. That is definitely a tent. I think people are camping out in this place. There's a bunch of them. I mean, I don't think this is a tent manufacturing, you know. Ooh, where am I going? I am stuck. Oh no. I'm gonna die in here. I'm gonna die in here because I can't get out. Oh, the glitchiness of this game. Why do you have to do this? I was just looking at tents. I was only looking at tents. Oh no, now I'm stuck here. I actually have to start from the beginning. Hey girl. Don't fucking yell at me. What? Something just exploded down there. Or not. I mean, it could just be another feature.
All right. Let's go and do this thing again. Contagion on this lot. That's yeah, that gun's not really strong enough. There are explosions happening down there. Bombs again. Okay. Now, where is it coming from? Somebody else saw me. Where are they? Oh, is that gun? Epic components. I know there's at least one more down there because I saw the red eye. Do you think people live here? Because I'm beginning to think that people live here and they like pay for a spot in one of the tents. Okay, nothing. 
thing back here. I do think there's at least another bad guy around, I just don't know where. Over there. someone else? I don't know. I think there is somebody else. I saw another red eye. I just don't know. Yeah, it's a big area. Let's look around. I definitely think that this is a building either for refugees or for homeless people. You got anything on you? Nikamata Tech Sniper Rifle. I currently am using a Tech sni Sniper Rifle. Is that one? Oh! Oh, it's better than the one I've crafted. That's cool. And it already had a mod on it. Hmm. I'm going to keep that one because it's got um, some ADS going on. Hmm. I'm going to use this. I'm going to switch this one out and we're going to put the better version on. <laughs> Oops, who did I just alert? where the bad guy is. I don't like going out in the open but we gotta pick up the stuff. What is this? Forever Young. Spam. Local network. Ooh. Okay, there's somebody deep in the bowels of this place.
Oh, there's a few of them. Okay. Alright. That's the information we need. Oh, we missed something over there. Okay. <laughs> These trash bags have had enough. They're revolting. Literally and figuratively. this Vladimir Shmikovsky if I were you I wouldn't do biz with Falter and his tombs they're pigs can't be trusted Yelena Sidorova I know so far he's playing nice plus he paid so this is happening Vladimir have it your way I'm rounding up the muscle and heading your way Yelena good Vladimir you 100% sure we won't get ambushed Yelena no but worst case scenario we just lose them Hmm. Can see one. You're in deep shit. Where'd you go? Fuck the beach! I feel like nothing compares to this gun. I mean, I'm trying other guns, but they're just not doing the same amount of damage. What is that? Crafting spec buzzsaw. I think it's legendary or iconic. Whoever this person was, I guess they were one of the bosses because subdermal armor. I need to get someone to put that on my uh, on my techie. Are you Helena? Maybe. This is Yelena. So what's the gig? Jerry Faultler, Miss Sidorova, we've known each other for some time now. Yelena, yeah, yeah, get to the point. What does the NC police commissioner want from me? Jerry, I'm not writing as police commissioner. This is a private matter. Yelena, sure. And? Jerry, it's about those bums on that lot in NID. You know which lot I'm talking about? Yelena, 
The one that Scop Sucking Bastard bought? Jerry, he's a developer, but yes, that one. To put it simply, the bums have to disappear. Could you make that happen for us? We don't want to make it official through NCPD channels. Yelena, we? Thought this was a personal thing. Jerry, fine. Could you make it happen for me? I can offer a good cred. Yelena, fine, we'll take care of the bums, but you've got to block your patrols while we're there so we won't have to fuck your boys up too. Jerry, consider it done. That's why there's nobody here, because the NCPD paid out these people to kill them all. Maybe not every member of the NCPD knows about it, because they're the ones who gave me this gig, you know? I know there's at least two more people around, I just gotta find them. I'm getting a lot of nice components, so maybe we can craft something when all this is done. Let's just sneak around down here, see what we see. So dark. Okay, is there anyone else? There might be another one. Or not. Are only nine hundred and ninety dollars for that? Okay. Right. Now, was there anything back here? What is this stuff? Stack of crates. I'm gonna turn you off. I'm gonna get the stuff that was, um, there was a person I shot down over this way. I'm just gonna grab the stuff off of them before I continue forward. Yeah, here we go. I'm wondering where all the bodies are because they must have killed a lot of people to clear out this place. Maybe they're in the trash cans. Well, thanks for your money, guys. Alright. And that's that. Where are we? Gosh, we're in the middle of nowhere. There's quite a few things, actually, around here that we could do. Uh, a number of things. I do kind of want to head to that Ripper Dock. We could check out and see what's here. We could go back to the Ripper Dock and get some of those... Um, items installed but i think i will decide that in the next episode because that's it for this episode i hope you guys enjoyed it and i will see you for the next one where we have so many more quests to do 
I'm loving this game. I hope you are too. See you for the next one.